Hey guys, it's Lemon here and welcome back to another Wild Horse Islands video. So this is part two of me making tech sets for my Halloween horses in Wild Horse Islands or just Halloween tech sets in general. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started with the tech set making. Okay, so this next horse I've actually had in my inventory for a long time but never got around to making a set for her and she's also OG stat Frisian. So her name is labeled as that. Um, but anyways, I was thinking I could either do the skull set or the candy corn set on this here horse to, you know, give her a cool set. You know, honestly, the candy corn looks kind of nice with this. I think that will make this our little candy corn horse because why not? Got this and this. And then this one here has mostly candy corn. It does have some wrapped uh, lollipops, but it's like mostly candy corn. So I mean, it's fine. And then I do have some dyes, so let's go ahead and craft, or not craft, dye her mane and tail candy corn fade, since obviously she's a candy corn horse. Ooh. I don't know if this fits the best. Mm, I might, uh, mm. You know what, guys? It's fine. It is what it is. I already dyed the mane and tail, so we're just going to continue with this. Let's see if I have any other items that could fit her. Obviously, we need the bridle, so I have this, or not bridle, I have a candy corn halter here. That looks pretty good. Alright, alright, this is coming together, and then we're just going to name this horse candy corn real quick. Because, you know, she's a candy corn horse, so we kind of have to. Is candy corn two words? No. Wait, yeah, yeah, candy corn is two words. Okay. I need to give her some hoof trails, um, because I don't have, uh, any candy corn bell boots, so I think the orange and black... Um, hoof trails would look nice. Oh, she's independent. I keep forgetting. Yeah, this looks pretty cool. And then she needs a saddle, so let's go ahead and craft her one. Oh, I ran out of leather. Alright, we just bought a bunch of leather, so hopefully we won't run out anytime soon. Let's move over to the sun. This will be our new location. And let's go ahead and craft. Tear, I think... I mean, the tear of her, um... Bridle is bronze. However, I do think that the copper might look better. We could do pumpkin orange. Or we could do autumn. Nah. I think we'll just do black, honestly. Yeah, that'll look cool. Craft and equip. Alright, there we go. We got our candy corn horse. And if I can get my hands on a fully candy corn aura, I will put that on here. But for now, we've got some lollipops here and there. It's fine, you guys. Next, I want to find a horse for this here skull set. So I was thinking a ghost horse would look cool for this. So I have quite a few. I am going to make a video of like all the ones that I caught. So I think that this horse here might look good with um, a skull set. Yeah, I think that one would be the best. So, let's go ahead and do that. I only have three school items, so we'll do the sports medicine boots, head ribbon, and saddle pad. I don't think I'm going to be able to get the rest of it, so I guess this will just be as good as we're going to get for this. I do think that a oil lantern would be pretty cool. This one I actually ended up getting in ghostly red, so it kind of matches the ghost theme. However, it's red, so I don't know if that would really match the best. I do have a um, obsidian one here. Yeah, the obsidian one looks pretty cool. So we'll have that. I'm not really sure what aura would look good with this. The floating candle one might look cool though. Yeah. If we do floating candles though, I don't think I want the oil lantern. So I think we'll just leave it at that. I also have a variety of witch brooms that we could do. A copper witch broom might be cool. Yeah, I have a copper one. It looks kind of neat. I don't know if it fits perfectly, but I mean, it's an, an it's another accessory that we added on there. Now, let's go ahead and craft a um, bridle and harness, or, and saddle. So, I think that we'll just make it black and copper. We could do ghostly black. That would be neat. And then, that would use up some souls, though. I feel like it would stand out more if we just did the regular black, though, so we'll go with that. Mmm. Actually... I think ghostly might look better. It stands out a little too much. We'll do ghostly black and craft. Alright, yeah, this actually looks pretty cool. You can't see it that good, though. It's fine. And then we'll craft the saddle the same thing. 
We'll make it an all-purpose one. Ghostly black and copper. Craft. There we go. Okay. I mean, this looks kind of cool. Actually, I don't know about the ghostly colors, you guys. We're having second thoughts. Can always sell them. I, I have a skull halter. You guys, I forgot about that. Oh my gosh, I forgot that I had a skull halter. So then that means, yeah, we will end up crafting just a regular saddle to go with that. Oops, it's fine. Wait, am I out of copper? The tier of the skull thing is gold, so we'll just make it gold? Okay. We're removing the witch broom. It's too much. I don't know about the candles either. I don't know if I'm loving this set, but I mean, it is what it is, you guys. So we're gonna keep it. Let's go ahead and lock this here horse. I don't have a name idea, so we'll just have this one be another name. And yeah. And then I also have this ghost and illusion here. And I was thinking that I can make this one like my pink witch set because I just think that would look pretty cool. If you watch my turning in souls video, like the second one, you will have seen me make this here. Or not make, get these uh, items. So the little cat and the broom. And then we got our hat that I got from last year, actually. So this is like a perfect little witch set, which is adorable. Um, so anyways, let's go ahead and continue. I don't really have too much in the way of other items. I mean, I have these glasses, but I, get, I, I don't know about that. So we need a saddle pad, so we'll just go ahead and make a baby pink one. Craft and equip. And let's also craft her some polo wraps because we need those as well. Craft. Equip. Alright. And then now let's just make her a saddle and bridle. We'll just do a dressage. We need a pink one so the clear quartz might look nice. And then color we could do black. Clear quartz and black. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. Okay, that looks pretty good. And then we'll do the same for the bridle. We'll give her a fancy one. Oh, I'm out of blackberries. Okay guys, I just went scavenging for blackberries and I got some on the mainland and I just got the rest here on this little patch on Mountain Lion on Mountain Island uh cuz there's usually stuff there. So, anyways, let's finish this set. It would be helpful if our cat was like a black cat. I think that would look cooler. If I can manage to get one in the future, I will, but for now this orange cat is still pretty cute. Let's go ahead. What was I doing? Dressage. Okay. And craft. There we go. And I think that this looks pretty cute. Name-wise, I think that Azalea or Raspberry would be pretty cute. Does Baby Pink use Raspberry, like, in crafting? It used strawberries and peaches. Mm. I mean, this kind of looks like a raspberry-ish color. Azalea would be cute, too. I think we'll go with Azalea. Cute, because I believe that's a type of flower. So, that's pink, so I think that would be pretty cool looking. So we got another horse finish. We'll go ahead and lock this. And this one has a name, which is good. Anyways, let's go back to our first tag sets, Midnight and Charlotte, because I don't think I finished them. So this is Midnight. Oh, I forgot to add a bat halter to Midnight. How could I forget? We have gold and silver and wooden. I think that the silver might look the best. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Oh, I also have this shiny purple witch broom that I could put on Midnight. Nah, never mind. Oh look, all this food just respawned in. That's perfect. We got a blackberry, two blackberry bushes. That's awesome. Very, very awesome. Is there another one over here? Yes, we just got four blackberry bushes. So if you need resources quickly, I recommend this little tip on mountain here because a bunch of food usually spawns in and it respawns relatively quickly as you guys saw. So let's go ahead and craft a saddle for midnight here i think that we will give her just an all-purpose saddle so we'll do amethyst and then we will do black and then we have enough oh wait or we could do a silver tier to match the halter yeah we'll do that perfect we have just enough blackberries too so this is midnight midnight is now completely finished and she's already locked and let's go fix charlotte because um this is what we have of Charlotte right now. So I also did collect some shiny white stuff. I got these um, polo wraps, which I thought might look nice. So we're just we're just going with that. 
And then we can also add her obsidian head star back. I feel like the mouth scythe is a little harsh. I don't know if I want to put that on any of my horses. We'll just craft a, um, I think this is fine. We'll just craft a saddle pad and then of course a bridle and a halter. Tiny white. I don't have any of that fish. We could do icy white. Would that match? Or we'll just do regular white for now until I can find a shiny white one. I don't know if I ever will. It'll be fine though. It's just, it's fine. Since she's like a spiderweb horse, I think I'll make her bridle, um, we'll give her a western bridle. We'll make it white so then it like matches like the rest of the white thing that we have, white and obsidian. Yeah, that looks good. However, her saddle pad is also white. Yeah, I mean, black would look fine on it. I don't have any more blackberries, though. Okay, guys, we're back and in a new spot because I found some blackberry bushes here. So, that's a success. So, that's where we're just going to continue this. Okay, so we need a saddle. And what did I make the bridle? I made it a western one. So, I don't know. We'll just do all purpose because I don't know what other one to do. We'll do, um, we want black. Would obsidian look good? I don't know what other tier I would do. There we go. Craft. And there we go. So Charlotte has now been completed. I think her tech looks good. I mean, it's definitely better than it was before. I do wish we had some more spiderweb stuff though, but I mean, this is fine. Okay, so for our next set, I have a horse in mind and it is this here, uh, Ghost Arabian. Um, it was given to me by a fan, but I did pay her a bunch of tokens for it because I feel bad accepting things for free. Um, so I paid her a bunch of tokens. So this is such a cute little ghost horse. I love him so much. It's my only ghost Arabian, so I'm really happy to have it. And it just so happened to be green. So that's perfect for our next set because I want to do a witchy set because I have these witchy, uh, this witch fade hair dye, um, which I think would look good with this. I mean, this guy is a stallion, but it's fine because we're working with what we've got. So we're going to go ahead and dye his mane and tail witchy okay that looks cool i mean the lighting is kind of bad over here but that looks cool as well we'll move out from under this tree so that you can hopefully see a bit better yeah okay so this is what we're going with and then i definitely i know i have witchy hoof trails yeah so this looks pretty cool on the ghostly um arabian here and now we just need to grab some purple and green stuff to go along with this witchy set. So I have dark purple. Does dark purple match? Yeah, dark purple definitely matches. However, this guy is a boy, so I'm not going to put a head bow on him. I also have this pastel purple. No, that does not match. I have this. No. So I don't think I have a good aura that would go with this, so we're just not going to have an aura. I have a bright green no mm -mm, that's too bright never mind i have this fabric green mouth scythe that looks cool that matches i think and then since it's witchy we'll put on a witch broom i mean why not for the tail oh this black cat might look good yeah because witches usually have a cat and then this is green a green little hat green and purple i also have this other green it's kind of fabric-like, though. So, I think we'll just go with the green pearl that I have. That just kind of looks smoother, and I like the look of it. And then, so we need to craft, or we need to get the rest of the set. So, let's see what purple things I have. Oh, wait, you guys, I have this purple fire breather. I think it was just equipped to a storage horse. Yeah, it was equipped to leaf. Would this look cool? Oh, that looks kind of cool with the purple. I like that because I don't really know what to use the fire breathers for. And then for tech, I think we're going to do purple and then emerald. I think that would look good. So we'll just make this one. We'll do some jumping stuff for this. Wait, can you craft jumping boots? I don't think that you can. And all my jumping boots are in use. Okay, so maybe I won't make it a jumping horse because I don't really have any jumping boots that would go good on it. So we'll make this one just a dressage one, I guess. I don't really know. We'll do emerald and we will do dark purple. Wait, can I make that? I don't have blackberries. Oh, guys, I need blackberries for this. Guess we're going to go scavenge again. I'll be back. All right, guys, I planted berry bushes and they're finally ready. So let me go ahead and get some blackberries. 
So now we finally don't have to worry about that anymore. Alright, we have 84 blackberries now that should last us this video. I'll probably have to get more afterwards, but it's fine. So anyways, let's continue the set of our witchy Arabian here. So I'm really liking the set so far. It looks cool. So let's go ahead and craft it a bridle and a saddle. So I forget what I was doing with the bridle and saddle, but you know what? It's okay. We'll just go with um, English and we'll do an all-purpose because I forget what we were doing. Because I did uh, cut in between this to have my stuff grow because I was like, I don't feel like running around anymore. So we got emerald and dark purple. That's what we're doing. Craft and equip. All right, that looks pretty cool. That definitely looks pretty cool. And then I'm going to craft a saddle pad. I'll probably craft it in green. Yeah, I'd say green would match pretty good with this. Craft. Here we go. Actually, this looks a bit bright. Maybe I need to do the pumpkin green, which is a fall limited color. Let's see. Would this look better? Yes, that looks a lot better. So let's go ahead and do our saddle now. And craft. Equip. All right, all right, this is looking really, really good. Okay, so for the polo wraps, mm, do I do the purple or do I do the pumpkin green? I think we'll do the purple. There we go. Craft. Equip. Ooh, yes. I like this a lot, you guys. Okay, now. Now that I'm looking at this, I feel like I the pearl like in the daytime just kind of looks like a different color, I guess you could say. So I think we're going to go with the regular green. Yeah, that looks good. I mean, I would do pumpkin green if I could, but we don't have that right now. So so yeah, this is our witchy set. I like it. I think it's pretty cool looking. Um, We need to think of a name for this guy, which I'm really bad at doing. So this guy is another um, just name. There we go. Um, so anyways, I think that that wraps up this video of me making my Halloween tax sets. Um, that pretty much uses up the uh, Halloween items that I have to make a tax set at the moment. I might have more in the future, but most likely not. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. We definitely got some really cool Halloween tacked horses now, and I will try and think of names for them. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you all enjoyed it, and I hope you all have a wonderful day. Goodbye, everybody.